Well, hello, hello everybody. I'm glad to have you here with me again. I thought that today we could do this reading on topic what's coming uh, next in love. So we will have a little bit more of piles and uh, this will be a short prediction. So uh, do pick more uh, piles if you feel called to uh, and or if you resonate with the numbers. But let's see. What's next in love? What's coming in love? What's coming in love? We do have some reconciliation cards, but let's see. Part one. Okay. Part one. Congratulations. Uh, well, as I can see from the cards, I feel like you guys may have been waiting for some some type of an outcome with a specific per person for quite a while now. I feel like this person your, is your true match, a yin, yin to your yang, you know, and I feel like uh, a new relationship uh, is approaching. Uh, and it is approaching in a very solid, stable manner, you know. I feel like it won't happen overnight, but it will be a big success uh, for a stable future to bring to come, you know. I feel like this is uh, the type of a person where you will have emotional fulfillment with, along with uh, financial stability. So that's something amazing for this pile. Uh, and I feel like this will be a long-term type of uh, relationship, a commitment for those of you who were awaiting engagements, it is coming, uh, and for those of you who were in separation, because I do have some long-distance separation, uh, emotional distance energy, I feel like you will be settling things in order with your person, and you guys uh, will start like you will renew your relationship it also applies if you are in long-term commitment or marriage uh, your relationship will be revitalized renewed you know for many of you uh, i feel like you also may move uh, with your partner to foreign lands because this will bring some stable financial prosperity as well uh, but yes this was our first pile uh, if you feel called to pick more and if you like reading, like and subscribe and thank you for listening. Let's see a little bit further. What's coming next in love? What's coming next in love? What's coming next in love? What's coming in love? Pile 2. Okay, I will pull a little bit of a clarifier. Okay, I feel like for many of you, you may have dealt with a connection where you guys were unclear when it comes to where you stand with this person. Perhaps there was none or very little communication. It was even harsh for some of you. However, I am uh, sensing that some truth will be coming to light here. For many of you, you will be finding out that this person is either single or newly single, so if you were wondering about somebody's relationship status or you weren't really sure, uh, I feel like some type of truth uh, will be revealed to you guys and for many of you there is a person and they may be air sign uh, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius or have strong those placements. Uh, and I am sensing also some earth here, I feel like they have this need to prove themselves to clean. Uh, the slate when it comes to you guys and to start something new and solid, solid uh, stable connection so uh, that will be amazing for you guys however I do have this feeling that this connection will be as much as it will be very much grounded but it will also be based on a very intellectual uh, mutual exchange so this this will be somebody who you will have long intellectual conversations with and i feel like this person will have this level of mental compatibility with you guys that you rarely encountered before you know uh their little bit of a downfall may be, be that they are more rational than emotional emotional type of a person but for many of you i am sensing that this is not uh 
not a vice. Uh, it even may be a type of uh, trait that you love uh, with your potential partner. So uh, that's something amazing. But the main theme here is uh, some truth will be revealed uh, to you guys. And now you will be the ones that will have uh, an option to choose and uh, option to demand things from your partners. and. Uh, that's amazing, you know, so if you were in any type of confusion or uh, illusion when it comes to this person, everything will be uh, much clearer soon. Okay, but this was our second pile. If you like this reading, like and subscribe. And if you feel called to pick more piles, but let's see. What's coming next in love? What's coming next in love? Well, I am sensing some date and reconciliation energy. I feel like you guys will be going out with a specific person they will invite you for coffee for a dinner for something of that nature where you guys get to uh, discuss your previous troubles and uh, everything related to this connection that was really uh, sabotaging it and uh, disabling it to move in a fluid manner you know I feel like uh, you have somebody who will be a very strong solid stable present in your life uh, presence in your life and uh, this is the type of a relationship where this person will be mother figure type or father figure type of a person toward you guys uh, those of you who like sugar daddy type of energies this is uh, something that you can get with this person and uh, I feel like if there were hmm, any suspicions about third party and things of that nature I feel like that will be all settled if you had jealousy and possessiveness issues because you felt perhaps that there was more competition here than uh, it was convenient for the situation the things will get cleared up and I feel like that that you have somebody who wants to take care of you uh, that, who wants to show you that you can count on count on them and that they can be a reliable influence in your life uh, so uh, I do have this strong solid stable energy of somebody who wants you know just higher level of responsibility between you guys and uh, higher level of uh, mutual relating so uh, that's something amazing if that is something that you were waiting and also I feel like besides being a mature responsible influence this person is coming back or entering your life as somebody with whom you will have a lot of fun uh, so that will also be amazing but this was our third pile if you like the reading like and subscribe and do pick more piles if you feel called to Let's see a little bit further. What's coming next in love? What's coming next in love? Ooh, great part. So I feel like for many of you from this pile, you recently had some type of uh, Mm, disruption, separation, upheaval. I feel like there was a person that was cause of a great gr grief in your life. Uh, however, I feel like this this has come to an end. Uh, for many of you, I am sensing a new rel relationship on horizon. There's somebody coming into your life who who will be kindred spirit type of an energy. I feel like you guys will be very compatible, like. Uh, your friends will adore them, their parents will cherish you and uh, want to see you as often as possible and uh, everything and everything will settle very much uh, in an easy manner uh, and it will be a great difference from your previous relationship because this will be an easy one, fluid one, you know, you won't have to overthink about this person. I feel like this person will heal whatever this previous relationship uh, destroyed. 
for some of you it will be a smaller portion this may be a reconciliation from an old relationship however I am sensing for uh, the large majority from this pile this will be a new connection uh, and I feel like this person will um, you they will compliment you perfectly you know how you have uh, like a narcissistic type of attraction when we like somebody the same as us and like complementary type of attraction when we like somebody with uh, opposite attributes I feel like this will be the second one because this person will be having what you guys like and the other way around so all in all there will be great balance and give and take and uh, this person although being much more different from you guys uh, and I am sensing for some of you foreign lands, foreign influence, foreign culture, ethnicity, background, uh, energy here. Uh, I feel like this person will uh, just compensate for any previous pain. But let's go on a little bit further. What's coming in love? What's next in love? What's next in love? Feel free to pick more piles if you feel called to and like and share if you resonate. Let's see. Okay. I feel like for this pile you may be currently in a muddy situation. You don't, you don't know many things, you know. Uh, however, I am sensing that soon some will, somebody will may be making type of a first move toward you guys. This person may have strong Cancer and Aries placement placements. This may also be somebody uh, living very close to you guys, so they may be a neighbor or something of that nature. Somebody who frequents where you guys live often, you know. Uh, for some of you, they may be a, your college partner or like study group partner or colleague or something like that like minor colleague like you may share a hobby together or some activity that you may be learning you may be meeting them on some type of a course you know however I feel like this person will uh, advance this connection very fast and they will eagerly and in Aries type of an energy prove themselves you know how Aries go to conquer their love interest you know I feel like they will um, make a great effort to show you guys uh, big initiative and assertiveness in this connection and I will be I feel like this will be contributing factor the biggest contributing factor that this that makes this connection elevate and take off the ground so that's something amazing so you can expect a message email you know uh, even I am hearing for some of you a cute message on a paper with a phone number from this person uh, where they will initiate some type of communication, some type of higher level of um, higher level of uh, interaction between you guys. So let's see a little bit further. What's next in love? But this was uh, our pile. Thank you for listening. If you like the reading, like and subscribe. And do pick more piles if you feel called to. But let's see what's coming next in love. Oof. Amazing. Amazing pulse, amazing energy this evening. Uh, so I am sensing that somebody is coming into your life that will be like king uh, to your queen, emperor, to your empress, you know, uh, whatever energy you identify. Will. This person will be bored, bold, courageous, assertive. For some of you, this may be your boss. Uh, this may be your boss and I feel like this person will be very eager and ready uh, I feel like there's somebody who is very ready to be in a relationship in a commitment uh, and I feel like you guys may and will have that type of a union that will tend to be monogamous but you will also feel free with this person and you will also have a great exchange of ideas of intellectual knowledge 
of uh, you know uh, intellectual way of relating among you so there will there will also be something very attractive about their way of talking the way they express themselves their tone of voice their pronunciation there will be something very much captivating when it comes to their talk i feel like this person will be able to mesmerize masses with their talk and uh this is somebody with whom you will have that power uh couple um, energy so that's something amazing uh, for some of you i am sensing that this will happen when you guys go to some type of healing for example you go to psychotherapy or you go to see a local shaman or uh, alternative medicine healer and that's when you meet this person uh, they show up and uh, you know just introduce an entire new world for you guys so you are having a solid very communicative uh, new beginning with the person who will cherish mutual interests uh, with you guys so but this was our last pile i hope you like this reading if you did like and subscribe and do pick more piles if you feel called to thank you for listening